my name is Becky. And we're the Sorry Girls. And today we have another organization video for you. Everybody loves organization. This is our way of kind of getting into that back to school vibe without really doing a back to school video. It's very September -y fall, get your life together organization video. Yes. So one of you sent us a photo and it was like the CB2 rose gold copper like wire basket. And I think you said like you bought it, but you love it, but like can we DIY it? Well, we did. We did. You're welcome. <laughs> this is our take on kind of the wire basket storage solution because a lot of times storage solutions are like practical but not cute. Like plastic. Not cute. So this is a really easy way to DIY your own wire basket. Here we go. To make this wire basket DIY, you're going to need a sheet of square chicken wire. You should be able to find this at any hardware store in the fencing area. We're going to be making this shape. To make it easier, we're going to cut out a full rectangle. You can make the sides any size you want, but for reference, our rectangle is 30 inches by 24 inches. Mark this out on your wire and use wire cutters to cut this out. Now we're going to add in the cutouts. These lines were eight and a half inches by eight and a half inches. Round your measurement to the nearest square in the wire if your measurement doesn't land perfectly on a line. On one side, you'll need to make your cut flush with the line, and on the other edge, you're gonna to wanna to cut halfway in between a square. This will leave you little wire edges we'll use later to assemble our basket. After the first one, you can place the square on top as a guide so that you don't have to re-measure every time. It's important that each corner you cut out has a smooth side and a spiky side. Once your whole shape is cut out, we're going to fold over the edge of each side to create a smoother edge. A heavy ruler or a flat object is really helpful for this. Next, flip your wire upside down and begin folding each side up to create a box shape. Connect your sides, use a small pair of pliers to bend the wire edges around the smooth side to connect them together. When you get up to the top, you can cut off the spikes on the edge we folded over. You only need to use the pieces on the bottom layer. Repeat this on each side and you're done. Don't worry if your basket doesn't sit entirely straight. This is happening because the wire came in a tube shape but once you fill it with things, it will lay flat. To make a fabric insert for your basket, start with any large piece of fabric. A thicker canvas will hold up a little bit better. We're basically going to be cutting out the same shape as our fabric that we did with our chicken wire. Draw and cut out your base shape. Remember to add a quarter inch seam allowance on the edges. And once again, cut out four squares from each corner. First, we're going to fold over and pin a hem onto each edge. Hand sew or use a sewing machine to sew up the edges. And next, with your good side down, line your edges up and pin them together. You should see a box shape starting to form. Use a sewing machine or a hand stitch these together. And once it's done, flip it inside out. Place it inside your wire basket and fold down the top over your wire basket edges. To give our basket some extra touch, we painted one of them gold. For this, you'll need a good spray paint primer and a spray paint in whatever color you want. Start by coating it with the primer in short, quick strokes. Once it's dry to the touch, you can repeat this process with the gold. We think these baskets would also look super good in like a copper or a pastel color. A quick tip on reusing material. We created a third basket from the corner cutouts of our larger baskets. So since each side is a separate piece, you're gonna need some thinner wire to wrap around the edges. This is a little bit like sewing with wire and you just kinda go in and out and wrap it all the way up each edge and every seam. Add a fifth bottom piece and you're good to go. So not too bad, that's how you DIY a wire basket and a little insert fabric and we are definitely gonna fill, you guys saw a little sneak peek of our like DIY covered space mm -hmm. shelving. So we definitely wanna make more, make some cute baskets. And if you're wondering where this new shelving storage room space came from, <laughs> room space. <laughs> little life update. I mentioned this on Snapchat a while ago, but if you didn't see it, I moved out. I love that Snapchat. <gasps> Basically, I just moved to a place that's a little bit more north so I could be closer to different things and it just worked out this way. So now my old bedroom is our new filming space. Which is amazing. And it works out amazing for us. So like we were saying, we now have all these extra cupboards now that we can decorate and design. And DIY storage. If you guys didn't see our DIY storage, we did it like pretty much this time of year, or maybe a little bit earlier. Last year, um, we had just like one dresser that was like all of our DIY supplies are in it. So we're just mixing it up, using shelves this time. Yep. But 
as far as the movie things goes, we're totally still friends. Oh, like, of course. That was not even a part of the reason. Thing. It was yeah. just a bunch of other smaller reasons that really aren't bad at all. It's just life. 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 So yes, still lots of videos. We're still besties, but just not living together, which is like not a big deal. Growing up, guys. Also, you should tell them about that, Becky. Shout out to Danny Wellington. They did send us watches. We gave a watch away in our giveaway. It was all very exciting. And you too can get a watch for cheaper. We have a discount code below, so check Sorry, that out. It's 15% off. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen the watches, they're really cute. They're so good. Check. I'm not wearing so my So pretty, today. so like classy but minimalist. And I love it. And check them out if you feel like you're in the market for a watch. There you go. There you go. And as you guys know, Halloween is coming up. So again, we are starting videos very soon for Halloween. So leave us your requests below and we just might do it. We just might do your costume. Get excited. <laughs> subscribe if you're not subscribed for lots of Halloween costumes. Halloween with TSG is going to be a big this year. Yeah. Those of you that know, you know. You know. All right. So if you guys like this video, make sure you like it. And if you love it, make sure you sub it. And we will see you next time. Bye guys. Bye.